when FCC, uh, the, the new pro soccer team in town, uh, came to the university uh, investigating whether or not to use Nippert or not, a big piece of that was a new turf. Um, the old turf was inlaid with football lines. Uh, the new turf was needed to, uh, for a transition between football and soccer to be able to have a, a soccer only facility and a football only facility at the same time. The turf is all green. Uh, there's, there's not a, a line that's inlaid at all. So it's all green turf where the football end zone would be and the center uh, CPAW logo is, uh, those are inserts. So for soccer, those are green inserts. They're pulled up. Uh, and then the football end zone and the center seat ball is inlaid in that. So they're Velcroed together, they're not zipped, they're Velcroed together. So there's a, a turf crew that'll come uh, when the transition is needed and physically roll those turf pieces out, put the new ones in, and then we store the, uh, uh, the, the old turf pieces away. Well, last Wednesday night we had an FC soccer game. All right, so that game ended uh, roughly nine o'clock. About 11 o'clock, uh, the turf crews uh, were here. That's about when the stadium emptied out and cleaning crew was done, and et cetera. So uh, at that point, the stadium was theirs for them uh, to begin the transition process. So uh, the green turf pieces were removed, rolled up and removed, uh, followed by inserting of the football turf pieces. Uh, after that, obviously, there's painting involved. So there's a paint crew that comes in, removes the soccer lines and then they lay down and paint the football lines. From there, it's just the finishing, finishing touches, making sure the seams are nice and tight and, and laid down, uh, the paint's where we need it to be, and then, and then it's the field's available for football practice some 36 to 48 hours later. I don't think there's many facilities in this country that can, can do what we're doing at this point. UC Athletics now can, uh, if we wanted to, to host other soccer games or our teams playing soccer out here, uh, if it's in soccer mode, uh, obviously, that's an advantage to our team. I mean, we had our women's team play out here uh, last week in record crowd for the state of Ohio to see a women's college soccer game. So obviously, that's an added benefit on our part. I mean, it's a consuming process. I mean, we, we're doing this, uh, you know, as a university university decision to uh, to bring on the soccer team, and obviously, it's a benefit for the university and the city. Like I said, um, and, and it's it doesn't happen overnight. I mean, there's a lot of people and minds that sat around a table thinking about this and talking through all the different variations and options. Um, this is one that our design team and, and FC Cincinnati and UC Athletics thought was the best and gave us the, uh, the most benefit on, on all sides of the spectrum.